on the outside. So we should have some action and maybe some passing and bypassing and repassing here in heat number 10. Inside then, Nielsen, Denmark. Next to him, Muller, West Germany. Big three, Dribble, Czechoslovakia. Outside, Sean Moran, United States. And there's some terrible trouble. Down has gone Nielsen and down to has gone Muller. And that was not a healthy one. There is Muller. And Nielsen is down still. And on his knees, Muller is back on his feet, but uh, none too happy, we can see. And Hans Nielsen is still down. You can see Hans Nielsen, the only Dane in the world final. And the Danish camp, there's anxiety. I can see Oli Olsen tearing across the center green. A real tangle at the start, and we've had some ragged starts, and maybe uh, that's the ultimate has happened. There's Oli Olsen looking over anxiously. Let's have a look at that start again. Now just watch the two on the inside. As the tapes go, you can see Nielsen appear to be burning coal. Away they go, and Nielsen snakes across, and Nielsen comes right across to mid-track and picks up Egon Muller. And there was nowhere to go but in trouble for the pair of them. And they both seem to be heading for the grass there. Nielsen goes over the wrong way, very awkwardly indeed. Muller, well, he's in all kinds of trouble. Somehow manages to avoid Hans Nielsen. The bike somersaults and cartwheels. And Nielsen goes down very, very awkwardly, but it must be said it looked as if it was his home fault. Antonin Kasper, European junior champion. West Germany have Egon Müller on the outside, Bobby Schwartz from the United States. America in the clear at the moment. Schwartz looks like he's already pointing towards the line as the tapes get ready to go for heat number seven. And away they go. And it is Schwartz from the outside. It is a knock there with Müller. And coming tearing round it is Schwartz who will not be deterred. Schwartz leads it. Second place is Olsen. Third is Müller and Kasper is at the back but despite uh, a tremendous knock as they ran up to the first corner Bobby Schwartz will not be deterred Olsen is being dropped and Schwartz who said that he was going to win this one for his teammate and Müller has come around the outside and it looks like Egon Müller is the only rider capable of uh, using the dirt and getting around the outside. He did that in an earlier ride, taking second place. And he's moved up into second place quite comfortably. And the Americans will be pleased about that, although Schwartz can't hang around because Müller is a determined customer and has the motors and the uh, aggression to get by. And Schwartz is aware he has the West German on his tail and is stretching away. No complacency at all. Three more points for the United States, second West Germany, third Olsen, not happy in the conditions.